Hello everyone, we're at Connect Tech and we're talking about UI architecture and I have Scott Davis with me today. Uh, so Scott, introduce yourself. Hi, my name is uh, Scott Davis. I'm a principal engineer and web architect with uh, ThoughtWorks. So Scott, what do you think a UI architect does? So this is a great question because the web has historically been this really powerful technology that no one devotes any time to actually learning. Um, they're like, HTML is so easy, I don't need to take any formal classes. But then if you don't understand the technology, we find that we have many, many div-driven, span-driven developers, and those elements are semantically void. We need to be using headers and paragraphs and, and semantic elements so that we can go on to conversational UIs. We can have conversations about accessibility and these things. So a UI architect is someone who's interested in not only get information on the screen so the pixels look good, but we have to have a broader approach to this. We have to understand HTML, CSS, and JavaScript, all three. It's that important. And I love it when developers come to me and say, oh, I'm, I'm, not a web app, I'm not a web developer. I gave away the punchline, didn't I? I'm not a web developer. I'm a web app developer. And I say, oh, good. All right. So you already know HTML, CSS, and JavaScript, right? I know JavaScript. OK, well, you got more to learn there. Right. And then when we talk about apps, it also includes accessibility. It includes performance. It includes privacy and security. And once we start having good conversations about those aspects and right. testing and usability and all of these things, so it is great that we have really strong web developers out there. But when you step up to a UI architect, you're trying to consider the entire package, just not the focus of getting pixels on your screen.